My name is David Boshin. I'm the animal curator at Prospect Park Zoo in Brooklyn. Well, we have a group of tufted deer. Uh, tufted deer are a small deer, and these guys have very little antlers, which are not branched. They're just little spikes. Um, they're covered with tufts of hair and the canines, which are real pronounced. No, they are not vampire deer. Um, it's, it's a weapon with other deer and also with any predator. They're generally fairly silent, but they do have a range of vocalizations. Um, you'll hear contact calls. They have a, a quiet grunt, um, and they also have a bark when they're alarmed. These guys are uh, native to high elevations, uh, up to over 10,000 feet. So they're adapted to our climate here in New York. There probably haven't been deer in Brooklyn for a long time. So we, uh, it's, it's not a native deer species, but we can now say we have deer back in Prospect Park. Uh, we're open every day from 10 to 4.30 in the winter. Uh, the deer will be available, so come and see us. And these guys have very little antlers, which are not branched. They're just little spikes. Um, they're covered with tufts of hair and the canines, which are real pronounced. No, they are not vampire deer. Um, it's, it's a weapon with other deer and also with any predator. They're generally fairly silent, but they do have a range of vocalizations. Um, you'll hear contact calls. They have a, a quiet grunt, um, and they also have a bark when they're alarmed. These guys are uh, native to high elevations, uh, up to over 10,000 feet. My name is David Boshin. I'm the animal curator at Prospect Park Zoo in Brooklyn. Well, we have a group of tufted deer. Uh, tufted deer are a small deer, so they're adapted to our climate here in New York. There probably haven't been deer in Brooklyn for a long time. So we, uh, it's, it's not a native deer species, but we can now say we have deer back